This is my little Atlas 12 by 48 lathe. I started out taking the 120 volt AC motor off of it and replacing it with a treadmill motor. That's a two and a three quarter or three, three horsepower treadmill motor. I forgot which. Anyway, when I first started this project, I took all the motor control stuff out and I put it in that big brown box right there and ran a cable up to the original treadmill control system that's up here. That's how I control the speed of the motor. Then I discovered on YouTube people were making these little devices here. Little PWM controller. It has a rectifier on the end of it. And it takes the place of the motor control board and this thing up here. Um, I'll show you how it works. I did replace this I think it came with 100K originally. I changed it to a 200K pot on it. It kicks in at about half throttle. Whoops, I need to turn the power on. The other advantage to this is, instead of using the treadmill stuff, is that wherever, if you get your speed set, you can set it wherever you want it, turn it off with a switch, and turn it back on, it comes right back to the same speed. And I've got a little um, cheap Chinese tachometer on there that inside the head here, there's a magnet on the back side of the spindle in one of the gears that that thing is reading with the uh, proximity sensor. So anyway, this thing. Screw up. It got almost a thousand RPM. Well, it did hit a thousand RPM. I usually run it at about three to four hundred, somewhere in there. That seems to work pretty well. The other thing, if I like the speed, I can just turn the switch off. It'll come to a stop. Don't touch the uh, speed controller. Put the switch back on. And it comes right back. I'm pretty happy with it.